Hello and welcome to this short video about Jaguar XK8. Warning, not just the secondary cam change engine is. This is episode 47 in my series of XK8 videos where I've changed my cam change guides and tensioners. In this video, we're basically looking at is it advisable to change just the secondary timing chain tensioners or the whole timing gear. Okay, so if hopefully if you like Jaguar XK8, so you're watching this video and you want to see more, if that's the case, please subscribe to this channel, press the subscribe button and click the bell so you're reminded of any new content. And if you do like the video, please thumbs up, uh, share and comment and I'll answer questions as soon as I can. For this video, I'd like to give a special thanks to uh, one of my subscribers, John Clemente. Uh, who's posted a few videos on uh, uh, his YouTube channel uh, describing an issue he's having with his cam chain tensioners. Um, in his first video, he, um, he shows the engine running and uh, revs the engine and you can hear an ever so slight knock or rattle. Just let it take a listen. Ever so slight knock. Obviously, John's picked up on that, and he he wasn't very he wasn't happy, so he decided to investigate. Took the left hand side cam cover off. I was happily to see that I have third generation tensioners. So positive. He's got second generation cam chain tensioners, so he's got the metal tensioners, but it doesn't explain why he's got a rattle on his timing chains. So John uh, decides to uh, investigate a bit further. In his third video, he's trying to look at the... Just as I expected. Only changed the top. Ooh. So basically what he's found is, he's looking down into the... Um, uh, cam cam chain cover, the main front cover, and you can see plastic secondary, sorry, plastic primary cam chain tensioners and guides, the original set. Now, that might explain the rattle. So it's very interesting concept. This so a lot of people um, prescribe only changing the upper or the secondary cam chain tensioners to the lightest type and forgetting this primary. But for this car, John's car has done, I think it's 100 134,000 miles. Yeah, it says 134,000 miles. So in this case, when your car is car's doing that sort of mileage, it looks like it's going to be better to change the whole lot, which is quite good news for me because I was in two minds when I changed my whole timing gear that maybe I'd gone a bit over the top. But uh, thank you, John. Hopefully, John is going to keep us posted with more videos on his progress. I will put um, a link to John's uh, channel, and hopefully we can all watch him uh, put to bed this argument of changing all the timing chains or just the upper cam chain tensioners. Thank you very much for John and uh, his, his work on his car. Okay, so that's really interesting. Um, if you uh, if you got an XK8 XKR, um, if you like this video, uh, please subscribe. If you like to see more XK8 videos.